Um, probably back in junior high, I sustained a, uh, an orthopedic injury and met with my orthopedic surgeon at that time. And I knew I wasn't going to be able to be a professional athlete at that time, so I became interested in medicine. Spoke with him and gave me some guidance as far as what you have to do to go to medical school and what it takes to be an orthopedic surgeon. And basically that's what got started me in looking into orthopedics. Um, I think as a physician, especially in this day and age, um, my job and my role is to educate patients so they can make good decisions for themselves. The majority of the things I do are elective in nature, and there's conservative treatment options as well as surgical. Um, and I, again, I think my job is to educate patients so they can make a good decision for themselves. Sure, there's emergencies, and in that instance, I'm going to tell you what you need to do as a patient and what I think needs to be done so you will hopefully get well again. Uh, but again, my big philosophy is, is educating patients so they can make good decisions for themselves. Um, as far as new therapies out there, they come out every day and they need to be scrutinized. Um, typically, I will look at things for a while, see how they do, um, check the current literature before it's something I institute into my practice. Um, with the web and everything internet-based, patients come in all the time with different treatments and whatnot. And oftentimes they're coming in with things that I've hardly seen and have to do my, my own education, or if you will. And I'll do that before I institute it into my own practice. My, my responsibility to my patients is to provide the best care possible, give the best advice possible with the latest data, the latest techniques, in order to hopefully give you a good outcome. As a patient, what I would hope is that you would take these under consideration and uh, ask appropriate questions and make a good decision so you can be very involved and active in your care and hopefully follow up more importantly with the aftercare, whether there's therapy involved, uh, taking care of a dressing or a wound so that you do go on to a, a good successful outcome.